Hi, welcome to my channel, Computer Doctor Tech. I'm Paul. If you, like me, are trying to install Windows 11 on an unsupported hardware computer and you're running into a problem, well, that's because Windows 11 24H2 will not install on an older computer. But Windows 11 23H2 will. Now, there are four different websites I'm going to show you that make available the Windows 11 23H2 ISO file. So stay tuned and let's get started. So the first website that we're going to visit is called os.click. When we get there, you're going to see that it's in the form of making selections. It's very simple and very straightforward. So let's go to that website. Now, in your browser, you're going to type in at the top there, os.click, just like you see there, os.click. And it'll open up this web page, and you'll see this button called Get My ISO. So when you click that, you'll be presented with the Step 1 family. You're going to select and click on Windows. In step two, you're going to click on Windows 11. Now in step three, there are three different things to click on, but you're going to select 23H2. Make sure that's the one you click on for unsupported hardware. Now we have build in step four. There's only one option, so you click on that. And in step five, we have addition. There's only one option there as well, so you click on that. Now, in language, make sure you're going to select the language that you speak and read and everything else. And that's going to be, in my case, and probably your case too, English, United States. If you have a different language, by all means, select it. Now, here in architecture, there's only one option, 64-bit, so you're going to click on that. And now it shows you a summary of all the things that we selected. Windows 11, 23H2, and it's 64-bit. And notice the size, 6.7 gigs. So it will take some time to download. How long? That will depend upon your internet speed and the speed of your computer. This button here, this big blue one, is what we're going to click on to download our Windows 11 ISL file. I won't be clicking on it because I've already uh, downloaded it. But you click on that if this is the one that you're going to use of the four options. This is, this is the first one I'm showing you. So the next website we're going to go to is called massgrave.dev, as you see. Link is in the description, so let's go there. Now, once we're on this massgrave.dev site, you're going to come over here to where it says download Windows slash Office. Click on that and now click on Windows 11. Scroll down until you see Windows 11 23H2, just like you see over here. And then you're going to click on this blue box, Windows 11 Consumer 23H2. This will open up and you're going to look for your language. Again, English. Then it's going to ask you to verify that you're not a robot. So you wait that out. Now, if it does have a check mark for you to click a box, click on that. Then it'll give you the option to click on the download file. So click on that and wait until you're done with that file. Now, for our third website we're going to visit is called archive.org, just as you see. And again, the link is in the description. So let's go to that website. Now, in your web browser, you're going to type in exactly as you see Windows space 11 space 23 H2 space archive.org and press enter. This will take us to our search results window. And we're going to click on the first one we see here for Internet Archive, Windows 11 23 H2, English US 64 ISO from Microsoft. Click on that. And this will take us to our page to download this ISO image. So you're going to click on that and let it download. Our fourth and final website that we're going to go to is called techubiz.com. So let's go to that. Once you're on this page, just click here where it says Guides at the top. Now you're going to scroll down a little bit to you find Download Windows 11 ISO. And here we're going to select the Windows 11 23H2 file. So you're going to click on that file right over here. Click on Download. 
And of course, again, you're going to wait until the complete its download. Again, I will not because I've already downloaded the file. Well, now that you've discovered four different websites that make available the Windows 11 23H2 ISO file, you can now decide which one you want to use to download it from. And then after you've done that, check out my video on how to install Windows 11 23H2 on your unsupported hardware computer that Microsoft won't allow 24H2 to be installed on. Subscribe to my channel, Computer Doctor Tech. My name is Paul. I'd like to hear from you, so leave me a comment. Click like, and I'll see you in the next video.